All right, I want to tell you a little bit about immunology for ophthalmology, but in relation to something that's probably super important to you right now, which is the COVID-19 SARS-CoV-2 mRNA vaccine, which we'll be rolling out this week in the United States, including our hospital. So the innovation was mRNA is injected is the vaccine and APC, which is the antigen presenting cell, will pick up this mRNA and package it. Then there'll be a MHC, major histocompatibility complex one antigen produced for the surface and cytotoxic T cell will see that. And that cytotoxic T cell mechanism is one of the ways that this vaccine is gonna work because the target is the spike protein on the SARS-CoV-2. So that spike protein will form the antigenic stimulus for APC recognition by T cell. The other thing that this mRNA can do, however, is the same process except different APC and different MHC. MHC2 this time. This MHC2 interaction with that protein fragment from that mRNA will induce T helper cell to talk to B cell, and that B cell will make an antibody immunoglobulin. So this is an antibody-mediated uh, immune response. So we have both the cytotoxic T cell response and the antibody response. Both are dependent on APC, antigen presenting cell, and that antigen arises from the mRNA that was given to you as the vaccine. And the cool thing about it is this isn't alive. This is just a piece of the, the virus. So we don't have to worry about inactive virus or killed virus or live virus. It's just a piece of that mRNA. And what that means, it's gonna be safe. And so as an ophthalmologist, you need to know a little bit about immunology. And that little bit of immunology means the mRNA COVID-19 vaccine is going to stimulate APC through MHC, major histocompatibility complex one and two to produce two types of immunity, the T cell based immunity and the antibody mediated immunity. And it's gonna be safer because it's not inactive, killed or live. It's just a piece of mRNA for the spike protein of COVID-19.